Welcome back. All right, roll your shoulders a little bit. How are your shoulders feeling? Are they okay? You know, if you have shoulder pain, and Bob's right there going, yes, I have shoulder pain, and you've learned to live with it, think about it for just a second. Because if you're just learning to manage the pain, there's an option. It's shoulder replacement surgery, and it's one of the many replacement surgeries that the experts at Excelsior Orthopedics specialize in. Now, they not only treat these injuries, but they also provide all of the therapy and care you need to get back on the road to recovery and back into life. Remember the days when you were a kid and you'd fall down, scrape up a knee and get right back up and start playing again? Well, as you get older, these scrapes and possible breaks start catching up with you. And for older people with pain in their joints or arthritis, joint replacement surgeries have come to be common. For years, now almost 50 years, we've been replacing joints in one way or another in the lower extremity, hips and knees. And they've enjoyed a lot of success over the last 20 years. It's only in the last 10 years that we've really developed the technology in this country to provide the same sort of relief in the shoulder that we can, we've been able to do for the hip now for the last 50 years. And why is Dr. Patterson of Excelsior Orthopedics so excited about their shoulder replacement? Well, it's because he is one of the leading experts in total shoulder resurfacing arthroplasty. I'll let him explain. What we've started to do now in the last two years here uh, at Excelsior is to sort of, again, steal from what we've learned with total hips and total knees, try and minimize the amount of bone that we, healthy bone that we would take out, and also to use a smaller incision. So two years ago when I did a shoulder replacement, I would go in, I would look at the shoulder joint. On the, on the one side, we would cut off a piece of bone. We would take a large implant like this, and we would drive it down a normal shaft. And then on the other side, we would replace it with plastic. And right now, this is the standard of care, and it's a very good standard of care. In the last two years, in order to minimize the amount of bone that we take out, we are now still replacing the glenoid side, the cup side, with plastic. But on the other side, the humeral side, or the ball side, we simply cover the diseased portion of the head with a cap. Dr. Patterson told me this new procedure shortens operation time by 45 minutes, decreases recovery time by about half, and allows people to function and feel better more quickly. They'll go home and they'll, be, they'll have a funny little sling that I'm gonna ask them to wear at night or when they're out walking around. But when they're a house, they can use their hand for say working at the counter level to eat, to read a newspaper, to do those sorts of things, that's fine. And they'll be showering within about two days uh, with the sling off. We start them in therapy at about 10 days. Most patients will participate in therapy for somewhere between six and 12 weeks, it depends on the patient and how much strength they had before surgery. After about three months, patients can expect about 80% recovery of their arm motion and within a year, pretty much full range of motion. Average age for this type of replacement is about 65, but Dr. Patterson has performed surgeries on very active 85-year-olds and wants people to know that if the surgery will help their quality of life, age should not matter. Another thing he wants you to know is just how special Excelsior Orthopedics is. We have a great group of people and it started with the docs. Uh, we're a pretty innovative group. Uh, first arthroscopic rotator cuff was done by one of uh, our partners. Uh, the first arthroscopic uh, ankle reconstruction for uh, what they call OCD was done here. Uh, and it was a bunch of folks who came together in a collaborative way to create uh, a facility and an operations that really you won't find for thousands of miles around here. Uh, you'd have to go to Cleveland or Pittsburgh to come anywhere close to something like that. And they have also added something new to the campus. With Excelsior Express, patients who have an injury to an arm or a leg, a hand or a foot, uh, can come right away to see an orthopedic surgeon. At Excelsior Orthopedics, they offer you everything from taking care of your strains, sprains, or fractures to overseeing your rehab to more complicated replacement surgeries. They will give you immediate access to an orthopedic expert. And best of all, they'll get you back to a normal life.
It's a beautiful place. You should check it out. Excelsior Orthopedics is the first place you should think of if you have any orthopedic problems. They'll see any patients two years old and up and accept all major insurance carriers. They suggest if you have any questions, why not give them a call at 250-9999 and they want you to know about Excelsior Orthopedics Express. It's now open Monday through Friday from 8 a.m. to 9 p.m. and Saturdays 2 to 7 p.m. You can find out more about their complete line of medical services by visiting their website at excelsiorortho.com. Don't go anywhere. Coming up next, get ready to light the night and help the Leukemia and Lymphoma Society right after the break. This segment of Western New York Living was paid for by Excelsior Orthopedics.